Hi, I'm Josh Goldman, senior editor with CNET, and this is a look at the Sony Vaio Duo 11. Now, with Windows 8 basically having two different interfaces, the familiar desktop from Windows past and the new touch-friendly Windows 8 style, we're likely going to be seeing a lot of devices like the Duo, which give you both a tablet and laptop in one package. Hopefully, though, they won't be executed exactly like the Duo because its design misses the mark. So here you have this 11.6-inch uh, tablet with edge-to-edge -edge glass ready to take full advantage of Windows 8. It's a full HD display with in-plane switching technology, so viewing angles are very good and it's nice and responsive. But it's also a little awkward to hold because of the widescreen and the weight of the body, which is nearly three pounds. Using it on a table or a lap is fine though, and Sony includes a digitizer stylus for writing or drawing or navigation. The Duo could then be transformed into somewhat of a laptop, but it's more like having a tablet attached to a mediocre keyboard. The keys are small, there's no touchpad, uh, just this optical pointer, and it's not very easy to open either. Uh, plus, once it is open, you can't adjust the screen angle at all, and it looks kind of cheap with hinges and springs and cables showing. It just looks unfinished. But if you don't care about any of that, inside is a very capable Ultrabook with a third generation Core i5 processor, 6 gigs of memory, and 128 gig SSD. Battery life is good too at nearly five hours, so basically what you end up with is a good computer with a compromising design. I'm Josh Goldman, and that's the Sony Vaio Duo 11.